So you said that Cleve was lying? No, I never said he's lying. I said he's dumb because... All right, moderation and Olympus 4. Dear Zach. Oh my... Oh no. Oh my god, guys! Come on, go ahead, go. Oh my god! Olympus 4 again? I was wondering if there was any way you could speak to one of the moderators of Olympus 4. Every time I want to speak with the guild members, people are either arguing or complaining about something completely unrelated to the game. It's gotten to the point where I can't even even look at guild chat because it's just people fighting all the time. I was wondering if there was a way that you could send a message to one of the GMs to fix this issue. Kermit. I I'm telling you, like... Olympus 4 is like... That's, that's the, uh containment you know like you know how certain websites have certain places for people to go to as like a containment area yeah uh, that's olympus 4 sure is sure fucking is let me read this Drea tv i don't need that anymore thank you i'm going to return that reporting olympus 3 members for conduct unbecoming of an olympian I, a warrior of Olympus 4, ran SM Armory with Benshi and Gouda of Olympus 3. Ravager dropped. Wait, somebody's messaging me saying that he's fucking lying. They're already saying he's fucking lying. Okay. Okay, alright, just give it a second. Just, just give me a second, okay? Uh, Ravager dropped, and Gouda claimed that we, uh, we had all agreed to give it to Benshi. This was a bald-faced, flat-out lie. He refused, uh, to admit it was a lie. Benshi admitted what Gouda claimed wasn't accurate, but he tried to make excuses for Gouda. <laughs> I have the screenshots. It's a toxic to assassinate a guildmate's character because he got the drop you wanted. The integrity of each guild member reflects upon the guild. All right, are these guys online? Wait, so the guy that sent me the letter told me that it is true. And the other guy said that it's not true. Uh, all right, all right, he says, what's up? Okay, I'm gonna move this to a window. All right. I heard there was a dispute regarding a Ravager. Okay, let's just see what he says. The guy was a healer and dipped out. It's not good. Replacing a healer is hard. Let me message the other guy first. Let me see what the other guy said. Okay, so, alright, Cleave? Wait, wait a second, where's Cleave? Um, so, he has, he has the screenshots. Okay, I was a tank. Wait a second. Gouda claimed it wasn't accurate. Tried to make excuses for Gouda. Uh, I have the screenshots. Okay. Gouda is a... Alright, just a minute. I was a tank. Gouda is a liar. Uh, that guy is a warrior, though. Like, what do you mean? Like, how is he... I'm a warrior... Yeah, he's a warrior tank. Just a minute, I, we gotta figure this out. Okay, we're gonna bring him in. We're gonna talk about this right here. Uh, give it a second. Uh, I, I'm about to bring him in Discord. And, uh, we're gonna figure out what happened with this Ravager. Dude, I'm cringing. What? I'm actually cringing. Ozzy whispering, he goes, If found guilty, Daddy should take them outside to the gates of the Iron Fort. <laughs> And publicly execute them in a door. <laughs> no, it, it, he went in the. You went in the wrong Discord. Please, you went in the wrong Discord, dude. You're in the wrong fucking Discord. Okay, Chom, can you hear me? Okay, what's going on, man? Uh, as I explained in my letter, the these guys are calling me a liar. Mm -hmm. You know, and uh, and it was false. 
And so I wanted to just report that they were trying to claim that we had agreed. Um, and that was just completely false. What about it was false? We, we all agreed at the Vulcan beginning the that all that three of us man. needed I the ravager. That. Thank you so much. And so when it dropped, I needed all. Thank it. you, thank you, thank you, man. And then when I got it, they tried to claim that I wasn't supposed to do it. So you, so you have a problem, but you got the, the axe? Yeah, I got the axe, and that's great. My problem is that these guys were calling me a liar, and it's not true. That's all. Since we're, you know, since we're guildmates, you know, I was just thinking that shouldn't happen between guildmates. That, that is stupid. That is really stupid. Okay, so who was calling you a liar? Gouda was calling me a liar. Okay, well, Gouda was claiming that we had agreed that it would all go to this his friend, Banshee. So, but that wasn't true. That was completely false. Where's the he was lying through his teeth. Okay, I can put him up on Discord. Okay, put, put him up on Discord. Or send him to me directly on Discord. You give, give it a minute, guys. All right, I've, I've got somebody. I've got, I've got Gouda coming in, okay? Oh, God. We, we got here. Got Gouda come out. All right, now we'll see. We'll, we'll see what's going on here, okay, guys? False. Why would you agree to give him the axe? I never agreed. We never agreed uh, on anything. We agreed. All three of us agreed that we were going to be uh, needing on the axe. Then when the time came, they tried to claim it was supposed to all go to ben The axe was supposed to go to Benchy. So then I called them out and said, no, that's absolutely false. They, you know, they wouldn't admit it. Okay. Uh, I'll see what he says. Okay, all right, me, now I'm presenting to you Gouda. Okay. So, Gouda, uh, like, basically what, what you're saying is that... So you said that Cleave was lying? No, I never said he's lying. I just said he's dumb because we... He used a tank and we don't need him having the Ravenger when we had already a warrior DPS that needed the Ravenger over him so we could clear the dungeon faster for more to drop. That's what my argument was, but he wouldn't understand that shit like he wasn't understanding so oh, uh, fuck. <laughs> okay see what i'm saying if our other dps had the ravenger we'd be clearing the dungeon twice as fast how many runs and did you guys do i did like probably a hundred runs yesterday not, not with, with cleave him? because no cleave we did one with him and then we got mad at him and we made a new party after he got the axe and we were just like fuck it we'll so, just make a new he party was tanking right yeah. Was the tank so with like a sword and a he... shield? Yeah, he had a mason shield. He didn't need that Ravenger. We had a warrior that could have used the Ravenger as we were doing the thing. Why you need on the axe if you're a tank? I was a tank for that run. Only not for that, you know, I'm a warrior. We were spam and, and, running and, and, and you and agreed the, to be the tank. We so, never agreed. You he lied through his teeth when he said that we agreed that the Ravager would go to Benji. That's a bald face, flat out lie. We agreed at the beginning that we all were going to need on the Ravager. That's what we agreed. Is that Whoa. true? Yeah, is that what true? Is, yeah. No, me and Ben have ran uh, Armory like 100, maybe 200 times yesterday, uh -huh. and we had one Ravager to drop, and it was with Klee. So Ben and me were so fed up with like not having the Ravager drop, I agreed to give it to Ben. But I guess I didn't... T I might have not said it to... Cleave when we were in the party. So, yeah. so Cleave was not aware that you wanted Ben to get the Ravager. And so Correct. because Probably Cleave not. was not aware that you wanted Ben to get the Ravager, Cleave need rolled on the Ravager. Now, was Cleave tank spec or was Cleave using a shield? He was probably, I don't know, he agreed to be the tank Cleave, for our well, I, I can just look at your screenshots. Okay, uh, it looks like you don't have any tank abilities. Oh wait, you're not 40 yet, so... Uh, were you tank? Were you arms or uh, a fury or, or fraud for that? I was using a shield. So you were you were arms, is what you're saying? I have some talents in arms, but also some talents in fraud. Okay, number one, that's a bad idea. Uh, number two, okay, that that makes it more complicated. Um. All right, so I I do think that you should probably respect to just be either arms or or prod. I think probably just go arms because you should be able to DPS tank the dungeons anyway. It's not a big deal, uh, and then you can use Ravager and it won't even be a waste. And that way, 
you know, everybody kind of comes out ahead. So you get this item, you're able to use this item, and also on top of that, you're playing a better spec. So that's a win-win situation for you. Now, in terms of uh, him winning the Ravager, I think that if he goes in and he offers to tank, because do you usually quest with a two-hander or with a shield? I do both. Well, usually questions with two-hander. Okay, so you're basically playing differently. Uh, and like, so you're playing differently for this group specifically to be a tank for them. Yeah. To, to so, run the dungeon. So I don't think it would really be fair for uh, Gouda. I don't think it would be fair for you to expect Cleave to not roll on the Ravager if he's playing tank specifically to help your group, but that's not necessarily his actual spec. You see how that would be kind of unfair? Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, like, but, go ahead. Uh, when we were doing the dungeon, you see what I'm saying? Like, I'd rather have a DPS for our spam group to have the Ravager over our tank that is not specced all the way for DPS. You see what I'm saying? Well, yeah. True. The problem with that, though, is that it's not necessarily always going to be like that. He's not necessarily always going to be in your group. And just because you've done a lot of runs with Binshi doesn't necessarily mean that the context of those runs should be applied to new people. Because even if you guys have done 100 runs to get him the axe, and he hasn't gotten the axe, unless the other person knows that this is a loot rule beforehand, it doesn't seem fair for another person to come in and not be able to roll on an item, especially if they don't know that in the first place. You see what I'm yeah, saying? I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so, like, I, I get the pride. I mean, the frustration, again, like, this is the thing, is that a lot of these loot things that I've had to deal with are basically just people that are fucking pissed off that their shit hasn't dropped. And I get it. As I said, I get it. Like, I don't know how many fucking runs I've done for this carapace. If I go, if I do the carapace and somebody else need rolls on it, I'm going to be upset too. I'm going to be really upset. So uh, I, I totally get where you're coming from. But, and uh, the thing with Cleave, I, honestly, like what you guys should have done is just had him two-hander, had him two-hander tank. Because if he's going to be able to generate all this damage and aggro, he should be able to two-hand tank the dungeon, and then it wouldn't even be an issue to begin with, right? Oh, after- I was willing to keep tanking. You know, I was willing to keep tanking for them until they got the Ravager, but I wanted them to take back their claim that we a, a totally false claim that we had agreed at the beginning that it would go to yeah, bed. I mean, we never made any agreement like that. News. And I just okay. wanted him. I wanted him to take back that claim. Okay. That's all. So and is that it. is that something that you're you're willing to like say maybe Gouda you, you didn't you might not have remembered if you said that before that guy was in a group or not? Yeah, that's what I said okay. to him. I you, if you read the screenshots, I said I may might have not said it to you. Okay. So then everything's sorted out. Yeah, everything's fine. Yeah. Okay. Now, uh, you guys say that you guys are cool with each other, right? Huh? Yeah, I'm cool. All right. Yeah, same here. Just right. keep running that shit, dude. And just, like, literally, like, Cleve, fucking respect, man. Respect in the arms. Spec in the axe specialization. Queue up with them again. Now you're going to have two Ravagers if it drops again. And you're going to clear the dungeon so much fucking faster. Like, there's no reason for you to tank with a sword and shield. 90% uh, of the time. Trust me. Sure. All right. Uh, thanks a lot for coming in here, guys. Hopefully, this sorts everything out. Yep. All right. Uh, All right. You guys on? Yeah, I'm out of here. Please. One. Move over to the Okay, there we go. All right. So that's sorted out. Everything's good. Uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, got him for sure. Well, no, we we sorted it out. That's no big deal. Change couple wives. No, it, it's not a big deal. Um, fake drama. No, it's. Dude, everything's fake, man. Everything's fake? Everything's fake. Yeah, that's actually McConnell and Esfan with voice changers. Listen. Every once in a while, some dumb shit actually just happens. Right, I know this might be a big surprise to you guys, but every once in a while, some dumb shit sometimes just happens. It just comes up. It happens, and that's all there is to it. And there's nothing you can do about it, nothing you can say about it. And that's all there is to it, okay? Preach. Looking for the wrong axe. Preach. Say what? Yeah, true. Yeah, big true. And uh, it, listen, I, I can sort out these...